The only people stupider than the people who claim climate change isn't real are the people who think we can do anything about it. Wow. The paper straw works terribly, doesn't make a lick of difference, but it makes people feel like they're doing their part. Mm. Can anyone see where I'm going with this? Uh, you want to make money by coming up with a product that doesn't really help the environment, but makes people feel morally superior for buying it? Ding, ding, ding! Way to go, Jane! <laughs> oh, this coffee is wretched and foul. It sounds like the start of a limerick. <laughs> this coffee is wretched and foul. The maker of this brew should throw in the towel. Nice. We should say this to Tammy. Maybe she'll take the hint and start making better coffee. I don't know. Face-to-face -face confrontation feels a little aggressive. I wish there was something in between being passive and being aggressive. I just don't know the term for it. Since someone's done the paper straw, why don't we do a plastic straw? I was just thinking that. Yeah, great idea, Kev. Mm. John, that doesn't make any sense. Plastic straws are the problem. Problem. Yeah, you know, I was just thinking that. But piggybacking off Kev's idea yeah. about plastic straws, what about just does wooden straws make sense? People feel guilty about their cars and the environment. What if we did lift, but with, I don't know, horses? Horses, yep. I was just thinking that. Great idea, both of us, mostly me. Also, have you noticed that Jake's been ending conversations by saying peace now? Where did that come from? As long as it means he's leaving the room, I'm fine with whatever he says. You know, it's funny, I was just thinking that. You know, that's hilarious, because I was just thinking that you were just thinking <laughs> that. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot to tell you. I saw John drop a comb out of his breast pocket yesterday. What? Hair comb or honeycomb? A honeycomb would have been less weird. I tried giving it back to him, and he vehemently denied that it was his. Oh my god. We have to get to the bottom of this. If I get any leads, you will be the first to know. The coffee here is wretched and foul. The maker of the coffee should throw in the towel. Let someone else make our brew so we don't feel like we're going to spew. Chunks? Pretty creative, huh? It's not gonna make the coffee better, but at least you're hurting someone's feelings. Well, that's a win, too. Hi, Tammy. Hey, Tammy. Hey, Matt. Hey, Jake. I guess we should get back to the grind. Peace. with John and the comb. I can't wait to tell you. And send. <laughs> <laughs> 